Most estimates put the number of pets in the United States at well more than 100 million animals. For many people, their pets are an important part of the family, but homes with pets can also result in indoor air quality issues, allergies, and trigger asthma attacks. Even for people without pets, they may still come in contact with other people's pet allergens. Allergies to pets are quite common, and both furry pets and pets with feathers can cause an allergic reaction in some people. According to the Asthma and Allergy Foundation of America, between 15 and 30 percent of people who suffer from allergies have allergic reactions to cats and dogs. Many experts state that cat allergies are about twice as common as dog allergies. Other reports indicate that approximately 10 percent of the population is allergic to animals. These pet allergies are caused by people with very sensitive immune systems responding to proteins that can be found in pet urine, saliva, and pet dander. Pet dander refers to material shed from a pet and is composed of skin cells. Pet hair, although a nuisance in the home, is not considered a significant allergen. Rather, it can harbor dander and other allergens such as mold, household dust, pollen, and other allergens. Because pet dander, and not the pet hair itself, is the allergen, short-haired pets are typically no better of an option for pet allergy sufferers. Pet birds can also expose people to allergens through their feathers and droppings. Bird droppings can also be the source of exposure to bacteria, dust, and mold. People can come into contact with pet dander by touching pets in contaminated surfaces and by breathing air laced with pet dander. When susceptible individuals come into contact with the pet dander, they may respond in a matter of minutes or the response may be delayed for up to several days. Symptoms of pet allergies include itchy and swollen eyes, runny nose, congestion, wheezing, and inflamed eyes. Environmental testing services can identify pet allergens in the home. To learn more about pet allergens and other indoor air quality issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.